action. And do you got look at this courtroom that they have Donald Trump in? You know, he walks in every single. Am I some kind of peasant? Do you really expect me to sit in these? I've I've sat in more comfortable chairs in church. This isn't it. Why don't we do this in Mar-a-Lago? Okay, I'll bring. I can redecorate this. No one needs to be this uncomfortable. This is. No one should have to sit in a room like this. This is a disgrace. My my hiney is supposed to be on significantly more comfortable chairs than this. They were also saying that uh that Donald Trump fell asleep in court, which uh Donald Trump's got to be a fun snorer. He... <laughs> Just I build a wall, build a wall, build a wall. Everyone likes me. They like me so much. I'm so great. I said, uh, she's an animal. She became a fat pig. I'm innocent. Him just pretending to be snoring in court. Uh, and then here he is. This must be the ultimate uh, ADD punishment. If you've ever had anything that will get Donald Trump just to quit on the spot, it's making this guy sit in detention and sit in some boring courtroom. I mean, but take it as a person with ADD. This is this is what's exhaust your energy. If you're Donald Trump and you're getting into fights on the Internet all the time, you're going to have to get into skirmishes. You get to yell. You get to shout. Like, that's excitement. There's some excitement in that. Even if they're coming after you, the CIA's coming after you, you got a you got a Mueller investigation coming after you. It's all a spectacle and it's excitement. But here you have the guys actually got to show up every single day. He has to sit there and he's not allowed to comment. If you've ever figured out how to de defeat Donald Trump, this is it right here. Where one he'll just, I'm done. I'm going back to playing golf. You guys win. I'm I don't care anymore. I mean, to think about Donald Trump just having to sit through this, not allowed to talk, and just has to sit there in this stupid courtroom. And uh, apparently, he's already breaking the rules. This was, uh, he took a call from court, which is fun. He's just sitting there going to the judge, hold on. It's one of my other lovers saying how good at sex I am, and no one's ever upset with me. I don't even know what this court case is about. You should hear it from this lady. She says I was the best ever and that my dick was totally awesome. Okay. I feel like maybe, Judge, maybe you want to take this call. All right. And then we have the jurors that apparently they finally picked a jury. And if there was ever a court case that you actually wanted to be on the jury for, I mean, most most court cases, everyone, you want to get out of court. No one wants to go to court. It's not fun. It's not fun at being, at being pulled off your job. You got to show up every day. You got to eat lunch at an assigned time. You got to watch this. You got to watch this lawyer make a spectacle. That lawyer make a spectacle. Everyone tries and get out of jury duty, unless it's the most entertaining show on earth. If it's the most entertaining show on earth, if it's Donald Trump, do they let you bring snacks? You should be allowed to bring snacks. I feel like if you're on the jury, you should be able to every single day go into bodega, load up like it's a road trip and just sit there with your Twizzlers. I like chocolate covered pretzels on the road. That's a good road snack. Maybe some beef jerky. Uh, are you allowed to have cocktails or do they get upset at you for cocktails? What if you can argue, Hey, listen, I'm worse at sitting still than Donald Trump. Uh, can uh, uh, like, I, I can just envision it's like that scene in where the Buffalo Rome, where uh, Hunter S Thompson shows up with this thing of ice and the bloody Mary. That's how you make court better for juries that have to sit there and watch all this shenanigans. Wouldn't it be great if the jury was secretly pro Trump. And then one day they just all showed up tanned and dressed like him. Or if the jury, you had some actual creeps on the jury and they're like, uh, excuse me, your honor. Can I ask another question about that lady's vagina? Excuse me, your honor. I, I, I'm just curious. What's the proper way to make hush money payments to your prostitute? Just so I have a full understanding of the law. Uh, your honor, can we hear it again from Donald Trump's side of the story of uh, what happened when he brought her back to the room? All right. And that is uh, it for our first topic, I believe. I think we just covered all the details of the court case. Oh, here's this is just funny that some some lady who got thrown off the jury was like he was less orange than I expected.